The discovery of the new species was very serendipitous, it's very strange. What happened is that it was the very last day in the field, really on the 11th hour, we went to a very remote place on that island where no one ever goes, and we just jumped in the water to see what it looked like. And lo and behold, there was a new species right there and there. The species is called Alprictis allelia, and so it's, the name is, uh, is a combination of my two kids' uh, names, Alessio and Amalia. Uh, because they help us all the time in the field. On coral reefs, usually uh, fishes uh, lay eggs or broadcast spawn, and then the eggs hatch, and then the babies go out at sea for a very long time. In the case of the fish I studied, it's different. The parents care for their young. It's only found in a handful of uh, species in, uh, on coral reefs. So I went to the Philippines just to study those two species that uh, that do that. The genus is called Altrictes, which means different fish because they are so different than anything else. You see uh, some gray small fishes. These are the babies of Altrictes. You see a few small yellow fishes. These are parasites. These are fish from other species that are hitching a free ride to be taken care of the, by the parents of Altrictes. Then you see a larger uh, individual, which is one of the two parents, and is guarding the babies when it sees me approach. There are very large areas of coral reefs that have been completely destroyed. Fortunately, in the very place where these uh, Altrictes are found, there, are, there is a lot of um, ecotourism and diving tourism, and so the place is still relatively well protected in the Philippines.